We begin with the U.S.'s latest measures against COVID-19 in America. U.S. President Donald Trump has declared a national emergency over the coronavirus outbreak. That includes freeing up 50 billion U.S. dollars to fight the virus. Let's take a listen. To unleash the full power of the federal government in this effort today, I am officially declaring a national emergency. Two very big words. The action I am taking will open up access to up to $50 billion of Speaking in the White House Rose Garden, Trump added that he's giving the Secretary of Health and Human Services emergency authority to waive federal regulations and laws to give doctors and hospitals flexibility in treating patients. Trump also said that he is considering adopting South Korea's drive through testing system, which allows people to go through the test in their car. The state of New York opened its first drive through testing center in New Rochelle on Friday, describing the system as smart and safe. Trump said that he will probably get tested for the virus fairly soon, as he interacted recently with an aide to Brazil's leader who later tested positive. As global authorities, including the U.S., ramp up their responses to the virus, Wall Street rebounded on Friday with stocks surging 9 percent.